Hello everyone and welcome to this slightly different video. I am finally back from the Nürburgring, uh, an event actually I was really happy with my performance with the combos I had, uh, you know, especially that last race, I think I did very well indeed. Now, if you haven't watched it, make sure you go and do so. I haven't watched it yet, but I've seen clips uh, and it looks impressive. Of course, I watched it live, so I do know what happens. Uh, it's just I haven't watched the YouTube a variation of it. Now, this video is all about Discord and the Mini Madness Championship. So if you're not interested in this, it probably isn't the video for you. I'd recommend you go watch another video on the channel or maybe another YouTuber uh, in their content that they've created today. Now, in terms of the Discord, first of all, if you haven't joined the Discord, please feel free to do so. It's the best way to communicate with me and other people from the community that we have here now. I think it's a great community. Um, and, you know, you, as I say, you can talk to people on here. There are event finalists you can see here. Um, I'm here, obviously, the ultimate pleb. There are lots and lots of people on here. So if you're after advice, you can get that on here. If you want to post pictures and videos, you can get on. You can do that on here as well. Now, I'll get to that in a second, but I just wanted to explain the channels because there's been a little bit of confusion about what to do and where, and I'll try to make it as easy as possible, try to keep it as simple as possible because that's the main goal here. Keep it simple, less to manage, um, but at least then we can communicate with each other. So, welcomes and goodbyes, that's literally what it is. It tells you who joins the channel and who leaves the Discord channel. Um, literally straightforward, you can see a lot of the AMS guys, hello guys, have recently joined the channel. Um, you know, everybody gets their own little message here, so you can see who joins and who leaves. Now, if you have a request or a question for me, you can do that in this Tidge Requests and Questions channel. It's got a slow mode on, and the reason for that slow mode is so that I can actually um, see the questions or see uh, the requests that are happening. You can see Double H, thank you very much, mate, as well. My Audi teammate from the recent World Tour um, has been putting emotes in here. So, you know, potential emotes for the channel. We do have a few here. Uh, you can see some of them. We've got the LOL, we've got the Flawless, we've got the, uh, the finger there, uh, and a few of um, Double H's ones. We've got a helmet in there and such. I always love that cone one. I think that's amazing. That took me like five minutes to make, and actually I really like that one. But even so, you can put that in here. So if you've got a question for me, and uh, maybe I've not answered on Twitter straight away, or not answered on whatever other platform straight away, this is the place to do it. So, you know, make sure you get those in there. So this GT Sports event finalist request, this is specifically for those people who join this channel and want to be recognized as a GT Sports event finalist finalist now to be one of these kind of folks you have to have been to a world tour event and competed at that world tour event um so you can see the likes of doodle in here you know doodles raced at the world finals at salzburg as well uh you know doodle actually got a win there with uh, nissan i think it was uh, don't quote me on that but he won the manufacturers uh, section of that you know we got dodge lamb in here uh carl lamb we got schnick uh side dog who recently won the uh the Nürburgring uh, race there as well with that fantastic battle. Um, so, you know, there, there's a lot of event finalists that have joined the channel and it's a great way to communicate with them if you want to do so. Uh, but they can be spotted here in orange. Now, members, member role. Of course, if you are a member of this channel and what I mean by member is you support the channel by being, you know, putting money across YouTube essentially to support the channel, to help the cost of the channel, uh, you get this legend member status because you literally are a member. I love all the support or, you know, I appreciate all the support you give to me because this channel does cost quite a bit to run, but you know, with the support that you guys do with donations and money or whatever it might be, uh, we've actually managed to improve the channel even more. So you've seen the editing's improved, we've got better music, because I know that was a complaint. Uh, better quality, you know, with the camera, it supports the internet to get the live stream going. It all helps. So you legend members, you know, who support it monthly, you get that status right there. So, uh, you know, if you are a member, and you haven't requested that yet, get your name down here. I will double check against the member list um, and I will then give you the membership status. So, we then get to the GT Sport area and we've got this chatteroo. So literally, if you want to talk to anybody, this is the first channel without slow mode and this is the reason why. You could just chat for days in here uh, and have a good old uh, chat basically with anybody in this Discord. Now, everybody talks in here. You know, there's loads of stuff in here. You can see that it goes on for days. Uh, I have 
kept up with it all actually I read it on the fly because I've got this good on my mobile phone um, so it is a great to you know talk with your fellow competitors fellow community members um, so for, please feel free to do that in the chat room pictures and videos speak for themselves this is a place where if you've got a video maybe it's your own video maybe it's somebody else's video um, or a picture as you can see lots of mini madness uh, livery <laughs> look at that flawless picture on that uh, livery there by Hubie uh, you can post them in here, and this is the place for the images. I've tried to set it up so the channels are like this. Um, so, you know, fire away with those. In fact, let's give that a, a flawless and an SR up there. And that's as easy as that with some of the uh, emojis that you can do. Now, Legend members, you get your own chat, of course. Uh, so if you want to chat with other fellow members, please feel free to do that in here. We then have the GT Sports event finalist chat. So if you're an event finalist, you can also chat in here. Um, literally, you know, if a lot of the time the event finalists might want to talk about an event prior, uh, you know, what are you expecting, etc, uh, etc, et they can do that in here. We then go to the Mini Madness Championship. Now, this is that championship that has been started for you guys, the community. I'm just going to commentate on it. Um, but if you are a competitor, you have your own little section here. Now, originally, this was open to everybody, but uh, I figured quite quickly there was a lot of spam going in here. Not spam, but um, the Chatteroo was the place it should have been, not in here. And this is where you want to talk with your competitors. But you can talk whatever you want about it in here. But it's just for the Mini Madness competitors. So you can see your name in green there. You know, there's 66 of you in here at the moment, plus 6, 7, 6, 68 of you, uh, plus the ultimate pleb at the top there. This is the place for you. You know, you can talk about maybe the combos or just talk about anything really. It's up to you. Uh, maybe even set up a practice lobby. We're going to have a practice lobby as well for Mini Madness coming up soon as well. If you want to take part in that, I will let you know via Twitter and the Discord as well. This Discord is going to be the main place for the communication for this Mini Madness Championship. If you're not in here, you're probably not going to be an official competitor yet. So make sure you get signed up to Discord because this is the place to be. If your name is in green, accepted. So yes, keep that in mind. Discord is really easy to sign up to as well uh, and really easy to manage. And I'll show you how to lower your notifications slightly. We finally have the incident report area, which uh, any messages from this point forward, really, I'll probably end up deleting from here. Uh, and that's why the slow mode is enabled. Uh, literally, I just want to see incident reports. And so will some of the admins. I haven't got them yet, but I know a few people have already volunteered. We'll get them supported in here. But that's the Discord, basically. And I've seen the voice channels as well. I've seen people in there, should I say. Uh, so, you know, you can have an actual chit chat in there as well. So, now, how do you stop the notifications? Because sometimes when you first join a Discord, you just get... BAM! Notifications constantly, uh, and it can get quite annoying. So, I'm going to explain based on another server I'm a part of. So, if I right-click the server in question, obviously I get additional options for that one. And if I go to notification settings, you end up with this uh, sort of menu. So, you can mute the entire channel if you wish. I haven't muted it. Uh, one thing I do do on every single Discord channel I join is I tick this box here, which means only the app mentions will notify me. If people are talking for days on end, I do not want to see plus 5 billion notifications, uh, which you will get on all messages. If I can do the app mentions, at least then if somebody does at me and wants to talk to me for whatever reason, I can at least get notified that way. And nothing means you won't get a notification at all. I wouldn't suggest that one. This one is usually the best option. Now, I also do the suppress at everyone and at here. So you can turn that on and off. Just with that click of the button. Whoop, stop clicking. <laughs> uh, but basically, all that does is there's an option to do at everyone. And I think everybody has the option to do that. So I turn it off quite quickly uh, mainly because sometimes on some servers uh, you know if you join other servers you can get a lot of notifications from this and it is quite annoying uh, and then we have mobile push notifications as well um, and literally that is it in terms of the notifications so that is discord i'll say within mini madness championship the signups for the first round have already started let me just get that up on screen for you uh, there you go so here we have round one. So you're probably going, well, didn't we sign up via the event registration? Yes, you did. But for me to make sure that all the round one competitors sign up for round one, you have to then re-put your PSN. You have to select the split you want. So you've got morning, afternoon, and evening. Uh, and then you have to split time information. So as I've written there, there's a high possibility that we need to open more slots. In fact, there's a 100% possibility of this happening now. I can tell you that much. Um, these times are just a representative. So when I say 10 to 11 British summer time morning, 
that potentially could go 9 to 11 or 10 till 12. I'll let you know. Uh, same for afternoon. The hour could get added on. And the evening, the same again. Now, there's a fairly even split at the moment. So, we'll, we'll look into that. Uh, but basically, you know, there could be uh, splits here or two splits happening at the same time. Uh, but they'll all get coverage. So, we do the first, you know, split of the morning. Then the second split of the morning, for example. But, uh, yes, that is what's going to happen. So, if you signed up for Mini Madness, you want to do round one. Make sure you get your PSN down. Make sure you get your split sorted uh, and hit that submit button. And then we, well, we, I will receive your response. But that's going to be it for this video, guys. A quick short one, that really. Oh, it's not that quick, actually. Nine minutes long. Uh, but that just explains Discord a little bit. As I say, a very, very good one or very good area to discuss things in the community etc it is really here for you and also for the mini madness Com competition championship uh but yeah as i say that's gonna be it for me guys thanks very much for watching um i'll see you in tomorrow's video which is a very nice surprise hopefully i'm not sure whether it'll get out in time um and also a live stream tomorrow so keep an eye out for that and i will see you then